I have been grown up in uh, Ras al-Khaimah. I graduated from the high school over there. Then I uh, continued my uh, bachelor degree in Al Ain uh, in UAE University. So it was the first university to offer uh, information technology um, uh, major. It was an interesting journey for us. I, I joined the university with an aim in my mind that I will be in the medicine college. Then at a sudden I changed my mind and I changed my, my whole career path towards going into IT and software engineering. And uh, I really liked the major, I really liked how we, are, we were doing the coding, I really liked what, we, what I was doing at that time. So I joined Dubai Electronic Security Center back in 2016 as the head of research and innovation. And by that time maybe the culture of research and innovation or research and development in the whole country was not well developed, let's say. They, there were some initiatives and there were some support, but we didn't have like clear vision on, on R&D or a clear agenda on R&D. So we were able to establish the first research, research grant in cybersecurity for the city of Dubai. And we were able to establish lots of labs and, uh, and research activities across the universities. We were able to launch Dubai Cyber Innovation Park as the main hub for research and innovation for the city and as the main hub for uh, creating talent and uh, upskilling the people that we have or the cyber workforce that we have in the city. So last year, His Highness established or announced the establishment of Dubai Digital Authority where four entities are merging together, Dubai Electronic Security Center, Dubai Data Establishment, Dubai Statistics, and Smart Dubai. So they joined under one umbrella called Dubai Digital Authority. I'm coming from Dubai Electronic Security Center, which is one of the entities that has merged into Dubai Digital Authority. It's, it's the clear vision that His Highness Sheikh Zayed set for, for this country when he believed in, in the humans and he believed in, in people. He didn't believe in, in, in the power of the oil or in the power of anything else. I think His Highness Sheikh Mohammed vision is, is really a, a long-term vision. So when he was talking about smart city, that was back in 2000, that he said that I want Dubai to be a smart city and a smart hub. And when Dubai Digital Authority was established, his vision was today we don't want only to digitalize the services that we have, we want to digitalize the whole human lives. We want digital elements to facilitate and to make the life of the people and the life of the community setting in the city more easier, more uh, reachable and more convenient for, for people to apply for the business services in, in, in the city. So I believe that communities and countries will always grow by having technologies being made in the country and exported to other uh, countries.